So another genius part of the Good Life Club was raising up leaders, not just teaching them these things, but letting someone else stay behind as a leader. And so Hosanna had this idea of raising up a junior ranger. So a junior ranger, she's going to tell you what they do. So the program is largely for a long time geared towards small kids. We sing songs, we do skits, play games. And everyone is involved, the grandmas, the moms, dads, whoever is not doing something else. We want to do something that had more of a lasting, after we leave, effect. So we came up with the idea of junior rangers. And the idea is that the rangers have all just gone through a training for six weeks. They've learned a whole bunch of new skills, land navigation, medical stuff, how to use cameras, how to interview people, how to get away from the Burma army, how to find their way in the jungle. And uh, these are skills that are valuable for everyone. Everybody. So we wanted to engage the older kids who are sometimes sixth grade on up, depends on the school, sometimes there's high school, sometimes there's not. So in the afternoon, when the kids are doing healthcare skits and playing games, we pull aside the older kids and they get an opportunity to learn 30 minutes of leadership from the newly trained rangers, which is actually really fun to see those guys. All of a sudden, they get to teach the things they've just learned. They've got, they've got their own audience now. So learn one, teach one, do one. Yes. So they teach leadership to all the older kids for like 30 minutes. Then the kids get a chance to choose between medicine, uh, land navigation, and reporting. And so then the, the rangers have been selected to do this. Take, take all the kids, they teach them how to use a stethoscope. They get to listen to their heart and listen to their is lungs. That what this is? Yep. And, uh, oh my word, it's like the real deal. Real, yeah, it's the real deal. They, they learn how to make the ORS so that after the rangers leave, we're only there for a day, sometimes two days, it depends on the situation. But after the rangers leave, they have a skill and something in their hands that they can do to help their own their community. own peers, their own community after the after the rangers leave. So they learn they learn medicine, um, land navigation, we leave them a compass. They learn how to use uh, geographical features to navigate the star or whatever scout, whatever scout. the rangers teach. Because we actually can't leave them with GPSs and right. things like that. So they learn how to use what they have um, to navigate through the jungle, the kids who are interested in that. Um, they also learn how to use a camera and a video camera, how to conduct an interview and do write a report. So if something does happen, the rangers aren't everywhere. Um, so if the village comes, the rangers aren't there, the kids learn how to take down the important information that they can either then pass on to their leaders or to the ranger teams when they come or whatever. Uh, we can't, right now we don't have, we can't leave them all with a camera. Sometimes we can, sometimes we can't. But they just learn the important things to remember and record for the future. Uh, we also leave, this isn't actually part of the Junior Ranger program, but a shortwave radio. Um, it's, a, it's a connection to the outside world. You can pick up all kinds of BBC, DV, Democratic Voice of Burma, different things, and find out what's, what's going on in the rest of the world. Uh, so what it does is it opens up the horizons of all these kids who are in the village, which is basically off the grid. They, they, they see the people walking through, not that many. They farm, they have their parents, um, they have, sometimes their school will go up through 10th grade, but there are very few high schools in, in, in the village. Most of them end at 4th grade, 6th grade, and then they're done, unless they move to a refugee camp or leave. So this gives them options for vocational opportunities they wouldn't have had before. It opens up their horizons to other things they can do and ways they can help their people without having to leave. Well, it helps them grow up and think maybe one day I could be a doctor. Yes. Maybe one day I could be a medic. One day I could be a photographer. So it gives them hope beyond just the village to something to aspire to. And I think what's really great about this program, if I understand it, is they're replicating in small the, the team of a free Burma ranger. And you have a team leader and uh, you have a medic and uh, you have a photographer or videographer who's going to record things and you have a good life chaplain who is going to uh, take care of the soul of the people and then what you have someone like uh, the, the communications yeah, that's communications what the person the navigator security person so but what it is is it's giving them a little spark of initiative so that it's not it's, we're not trying to create a, a, a thing where people expect help to come to them we're trying to get them to to say, I can, you know, I can do it. I can help my people. I can do something. It's that you can give them a fish or teach them how to fish, and when you leave, they know how to fish. Um, and so, you know, one thing when when Dave started FBR, he kind of said the dict, you know, there's this dictator situation, and there's all this violence happening, and we can't necessarily stop that. That's a big problem. But what they can't do either is stop us from trying to help each other. 
And so we want that to go all the way from the bottom to the top is, you know, bad people, <laughs> the Satan dictators, they can control a lot of things and they can do a lot of things to you, but they can't stop you from helping each other, from loving each other, from standing together um, against against that bad. So this is just very practical ways that the kids, kids that we're working with, which is the future of of these people overcome evil with good yep can stand up and say i can do something so that's kind of the idea of junior ranger to thank start you with Hosanna.